The vision of Abundant Life is to be a multicultural, family-oriented, Christian worship church that teaches the abundant life, thus growing whole people, body, soul, and spirit who prosper in all that we do, showing God's love to everyone and reaching the lost at any cost. Abundant Life friends and family. During the month of January and moving forward, we will start back up with our baptisms and baby dedications. These will take place every fourth Sunday of the month starting in February. If your family or anyone you know would like to take part in these, please contact Deacon Janelle Arroyo or email our church office. Abundant Life partners and friends. Please join us as we commence our 21-day corporate fast starting January 2nd to January 23rd. During this time, we will refrain from eating meats and sweets. We will also take part in a devotional along with prayer and consecration that will be sent out daily. For any questions or concerns, reach out to the church office, our website, or contact Minister Court. Helps Ministry Impartation To Abundant Life members, partners, and friends, join us as we go to new levels in our ministry. We need to ensure that we are all on one accord and keeping up with the vision of Abundant Life. We will have Helps Impartation fourth Saturday of each month at 11 a.m. Here with Pastor Robert, we will dive deeper into the vision, all while being strengthened to go to greater heights in our service to the kingdom of God. You don't want to miss out. Abundant Life members, partners, and friends, do you enjoy cleaning clutter and organizing? Well, starting next week, January 14th, we will be doing a church clean-out organizing storage campaign. Light refreshments will be provided. If you're available and would like to help, please see Minister Court for more information. It's almost that time, Abundant Life. The Love Month is about to begin. We are planning an evening of fun and fellowship on Saturday, February 11th at 5 p.m. This event is open to both married and single people. Registration is open now. Please go to alfc-pa.org to register today. More details to follow. not even free to make proper decisions because you have a yoke on you. The yoke tells you what to do. The yoke makes decisions for you. The yoke tells you don't, you know, the, that you don't need worship. The yoke is the one, you better hear what I'm saying. The yoke makes the, the makes, gives you the desire for demonic people. The yoke attracts you to drugs. The yoke causes you to make bad choices because yokes keep you from experiencing God's best. Yokes will control you Yokes will cause you to think a certain way and create a pattern in your life. And normally that pattern causes you to walk away from the plan and purposes of God. It it never ushers you into his plan. It exercises control in a cruel way. Can never let nobody know this. They'll never look at you right. Who cares about how you look at me? Most important is that I get free. 